Hi guys, I'm Nikki. Welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've been here before. Um, today is the second video in my mini series about bargain games that I've picked up on the eShop and today we're talking about Breakfast Bar Tycoon so I hope you enjoy. Just to remind you or if you didn't watch my previous video I gave myself a £10 budget and basically challenged myself to get as many half decent games as I could in the Nintendo eShop sale. Um, I ended up getting nine games in total and I did go slightly over budget at £10.65 for those nine games. Now this one cost 89 pence down from an original price of £4.49 um, and this one is on sale until the 10th of July. I basically picked this one up because pretty much everything else in my basket was a platformer um, and I thought I ought to try mixing it up a bit. Um, so this one is a strategy game and, and I'm sure you'll be really surprised to hear uh, that the aim of the game is to run a successful breakfast bar. Um, to be honest this is really quite a clunky game to play. Um, it did take me a few rounds to get to grips with the controls because they don't really seem to make any logical sense um, but after basically some button bashing to, to figure it out I did get there in the end. Again you probably won't be surprised to hear that um, this is quite a dull game. <laughs> basically you have customers uh, that come up to the bar you have to serve them their breakfast, be it toast, coffee, whatever it is they want uh, with the correct toppings and you have to do it to a time limit. The quicker you serve the customer, the bigger the tip they leave um, and in turn with the money you earn, you can then buy upgrades to make the game easier. Um, dull as it was, I was still a big fan of the double toaster and double coffee machines because it did make life a lot easier. As you'd expect uh, with any game, the difficulty increases as you go along with the customers coming through more quickly um, and extra food items becoming available for you to navigate. Um, but despite that, it, it really is a very basic game. I didn't play this one for long. Um, there wasn't an awful lot to it um, and I was keen to try out some of the other games that I'd picked up in the sale. Um, I'm glad really that it only cost 89p <laughs> because any more than that I'd have probably been pretty annoyed. Um, it's certainly in my opinion not worth £4.49 um, but there are a whole bunch of these kinds of games with different themes um, so if this is the kind of game you enjoy and I'm some, sure there are some people that um, do <laughs> you might want to keep an eye out and pick this one up now um, or keep an eye on it if it goes back in the sale. So guys, that's everything for today. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please hit like and maybe leave a comment below for me. Um, if you've enjoyed the video and you want to see more of my content or check out the next video in this mini series, then please do feel free to hit subscribe. Uh, take care and thanks for watching. Bye.